expects it to go the distance. I can't wait as we get things underway tonight. Both these teams look ready to go, as does the official. Let's bring it on. Every game critical in the postseason. This one no different, and we are underway. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Job. Here's a shot! Oh my goodness, it stayed out! What a save! It was all but in, James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. Centering P! Great defensive play to pick off the pass! Moves it quickly over to Dragachov. There's back to back saves! Relentless pressure! How many bodies in the way? And there's another stop! You can certainly tell that the goaltender is dialed in on that last sequence of saves, James. He's to position, so he finds a way to make multiple saves back to back. Scores! Rips it upstairs and in! There it is, James, the first goal of this playoff series, and everyone wanted that one. You want to play with the lead, and you certainly want to dictate it. Nizzik Kemp's hard work pays off as they get on the board first here tonight. Yeah, getting on the board first over halfway through the first period. And, you know, there hasn't been much going on here in this game. It's been back and forth, but it's starting to open up with this first goal. Got to hope that there's some more offense in this one. And he takes the feed. Turn that one aside. It's in the back of the end. They score! And that might be an own goal. Yeah, I think you're right. Uh, I think so, James. I, I mean, goaltenders are so good at tracking the puck and fighting to find it. And I don't think he saw it or knew where it was, so his feet start swimming in the crease, and as a result, the puck goes in. That's a tough one. Nizzik Kemp's in control of this one so far, Cheryl, wouldn't you say, with a two-goal lead? Absolutely, James, and often you don't see this urgency until the end of the game, but they started with it, and as a result, they've got a two-goal lead. Nice job tying up his opponent. Start with possession and look to get shots to the net. It is the tone setter. Here's a shot denied by the puck stopper. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. And they win the face off and set up to go on the attack. And there it is in the back of the net for the power play tally.
It's amazing and an emotional charge and what it can do for your team in particular when someone who scores it does the dirty work. They work hard, they're courageous in their play and they exhibit the intangible. In the final moments of this period, Russia's still down a goal here, but they have really picked up the tempo these last few minutes. And nearing the final 60 seconds of this opening stanza. And lowers the boom with a big time hit. Now, this is a message sending hit, isn't it? When you get all of your opponent and you're able to separate the body from puck, you know you've done your job. Message delivered. There's the buzzer, 20 minutes in the books, second period just around the corner. Nominations for our team player awards are available in the concourse in the lower seating level. Well, let's see what period two has in store for us as they are about to drop the puck. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? Russia's start was lackluster, James, and their coaches will not be impressed. I mean, they didn't manage the puck at the blue lines. They turned it over a lot. They're going to have to find a way to have quick close support and try and create some kind of momentum heading into the second. Shot! Puck goes off the glove! Gives him a tap with a stick, and the referees don't like it. Let's see what the officials say. Tough spot to be in. You need momentum and you give it back by going on the PK when you're trailing by one. As they step into the face-off circle, let's see if they can take advantage on this power play. First opportunity on the power play in this game. And specialty teams are the difference so many times in a game. Huge for them to set the tone and really get the setup and the looks they're looking for. continues to get to the net with that quick release shot he's going to convert at some point in this game spectacular stop by the goaltender how did he hang on to that oh look at this they have really stopped and they put the power in power play well this power play will show up in the video room tomorrow there's no question about that because it had it all Puck movement, motion, and urgency on retrieval, which I think is absolutely critical. Yes, got to start with the puck. You want to find a way to get the shot to the net, and it winds up in the back of it. Nissen Kemp's now up by two here in the second. They've really pushed the pace this entire game, James. It's going to be a question as to whether they can really close it out. And their first few strides have been urgent. That tells me they've been prepared right from puck drop. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. And it's poked away in the neutral zone. Nice heads up play there. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. The Nationals will lose a man tripping the call. I love the 1-3-1 -one -one set on the power play unit they used earlier. Listen, they had success, they scored, but there's so many variations off of it. I love the bumper position that can act as a decoy, allow the puck to get through to create those seams and open up those shot attack lanes. Tries to the crease, decides to think about it. Referee's hand shoots high in the air. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up. And the officials will pass the sentence here. Uh, coaches hate stick infractions. They're real frustrating. You're right there. You're in and around the puck. You go fishing and you wind up in the box. Missing Kent's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. They've already scored on the power play tonight, James, and if it ain't broke, you don't fix it. The coach has got them all ready to go, fired up. They've worked endlessly on this setup, and man, is it working tonight. Nissen Kent's through center right now in the offensive end. Nissen Kent's got the puck in the defensive end. 
takes the pass. Nice save from point blank range. I really like the save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Durgachev's at the face-off dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. Rush has got it in the defensive zone. They move the puck out of harm's way. He's got a step. Scores! Puts it in the back of the net, and that's how you light the lamp. He lights the lamp as he buries that one, James. But he knows he has confidence, and he shows just that in that battle. Execution, that's how you do it. Great play from start to finish as he executes with some great speed to break away from the pack. And then it's all about the execution. When you're one-on-one -on -one with a goaltender, you bring yourself back to your practice days and you use your move. Rush has suddenly made this a lot more intriguing here in this second period. I know it's cliche, James, but the game is 60 minutes. It's only the second and they've got themselves within one. A lot of runway to go. Takes the feet at the back end. Oh, stopped it! What a save on the play! And there's nothing technical about that. That is all about the will to find a way to make that save incredible, James. I love it. Oh, he had that corner, but he puts it off the outside of the post. Scores! And look at that. The rookie gets hit on the playoff score. We all talk about embracing the nervous energy. Now he can take a breath, feel good about himself, and let the creativity flow. Quick transition and a counter strike, James, as the puck score one way towards your end, and then it winds up going north. And guess what? You are the recipient of speed off the rush, and you find a way to cash in. Beautiful play from start to finish. Here in the late going of the frame, Nissen Kemp's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. And they send it right back to him. What a hit on the play! Oh, oh. <laughs> Love it. There's the buzzer bringing period number two to a close. Hey, listen, we've got lots more in store here on this broadcast. <sighs> Welcome back. James Sabalski ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. All right, the puck is dropped on the third and final frame. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? The Nationals are in the lead in the third period. It's been an entertaining game of hockey, but it's all about the offense and how much you can generate. Sky high numbers off the charts, but zero defensive metrics on display. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Quick shot. Great save. Dee's got it along the wing. And he's taken down. Officials are signaling for a penalty. Here comes the call. The Avs are being called for tripping. And they'll roll the power play unit right back out. Well, they've worked on this setup in practice on the power play. It's already worked for them this evening, James. You can certainly see the confidence that they have in this particular setup. The man has it been effective. Well, here we go. Big time face-off in the offensive zone for this power play unit. Uh, and they haven't made any mistakes, right, James? They're moving the puck. They're finding ways to attack the net. They just haven't put it. Stars! And they strike once again with the extra attacker. Now, well, this has been a potent power play. And two things you need. You need creativity, but you also need structure. And the players know exactly where they need to be set up to work their magic around the perimeter and then open up the lanes to attack the net. Nizzy Kent's been running away with this one since the beginning of the game and no signs of slowing down in the third. It's been a productive night and this is one of those games that gives everyone confidence and this is important for your lineup as everyone gets it as they feel like they're contributing. From right out of midair, he bats it down. Delay penalty looming. Whistle blown, stopping the play. And the body language on the bench says it all, James. They're all looking up at the time on the clock to see if they'll continue to run because they got to kill off this penalty when they're down a bunch of goals. The Nationals. 
Nation will send their man advantage unit out once more. Power play scored earlier tonight, and that gives you so much confidence heading into this one. You know how you executed the first time, but we'll be looking for those same openings. And makes the routine save. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Steps inside the line. Sends it in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Big play inside the defensive zone. He might have a step here. He's in. Great play by the tender to anticipate and get across to make that save. Shot! Oh, saved it! What a stop! And they're clicking now! Well, the opponent has no answer for them right now because they're relentless on the puck. They've earned some momentum after multiple back-to-back -back goals, James. They don't want to leave any breathing room and let their opponent get some life back. Well, you fully understand why the coach made the goaltending change, James. You wanted to get your starter out of the net. You want to reset your group. Try and see if you can garner some momentum, and it might come off of a save by your goaltender who's come in relief. But unfortunately, that doesn't happen. The team just isn't playing well, and another one winds up in the back of the net. Miz and Kent's playing almost like they want a day off here tomorrow, Cheryl. Yeah, I'd say so, and you always look forward to a day off, and this coaching staff has got to be impressed with this team tonight. You know, the ability to get the puck to net, driving the pace of play, and just having really great habits, consistent effort right through the game. Denied by the goaltender. Goaltender covers up. we got a stoppage in play. They win the draw and go on the attack. Park goes out of play. We got a face-off coming up. Shot! Oh, and he puts it wide of the net. Well, and this is a near-miss, James. You're trying to be accurate. You know how good the goaltenders are, and you just missed by a few inches. And that goes straight over the net. And I'm not sure you had full control of that puck, James. Puts it off the outside of the frame. Here we go. Look at this. They're really applying the squeeze down in the offensive end. Nice zone entry from the left. And as the final seconds tick off the clock, the home fans acknowledging what they just saw tonight. Here's a shot, and he hangs on just as time runs out. And we are all over with this one. An impressive team effort as they take the first one and draw the proverbial first blood in the series, Cheryl. Yeah, and that's exactly how they would have drawn it up, James. You want to make sure that you're the one that establishes the and pace of the game right off the top. And you want to set the tone. Well, they did that. And now their opponent's squeezing their sticks a little tight. Thanks so much for joining us for this postseason action. And we will see you at the next playoff game. See you, everybody.